Yo, what's up, people? What's up, what's up? I am back again with another video. Jonah TV War. Another day at the studio. Today, I'm going to deal with, you know, something different. All right. I'm going to deal with the three different types of abuse. I'm going to say it again. In this message, I'm going to deal with about the three different types of of abuse all right you had the emotional abuse you have a mental abuse you have a physical abuse all right and for all of you people who listen to this you know you heard me i'm pretty much sure have experienced one of these three type of abuse or experience all of it you understand you have the emotional abuse a mental abuse in the physical abuse all right and in this message i'm going to deal with to open up your eyes to the stuff and break it down to you to show you you know what's going on and how this works and things and you aren't dealing with or things you're already dealt with in your life in your past three 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 types of the abuse all right emotional abuse you got mental abuse and you have the physical abuse, all right? And the physical abuse is, and we always see, you always see the physical abuse. You see the movies and in the streets, you know, we see um, all over the place in the parking lots, in the families, and some of you are into your uh, uh, physical abuse, you know, someone, someone, this is someone's abusing you. The physical abuse is when, you know, a man is beating on a woman like crazy, or a woman and beating on the man, or a woman is beating on her kids, and someone, and someone is beating on you. It includes the teacher beating on the students, and even the principal. You know what I'm saying? All, all over. You know, or your mother is beating on you, or your father was beating on you. You're going through a physical abuse. Okay, you're going through physical abuse. Okay, you understand if you am beat on or even being bullied, you're being be on and being bullied, you are experiencing physical abuse. If your mom is beating on you for no reason, or your dad, if your boyfriend beating on you, even your girlfriend is putting hers on you. And nowadays, you have women at liberty to put their hands on a man due to the woman being angry, a demon possessed, and emotional, frustrated, and emotionally cursed. Now you have women who are liberty putting their hands on men, trying to start an organ, start some fights, and all that stuff, okay? You know what I'm saying? You're going through physical abuse, okay? Same thing for man. Man be beating on woman, slap the woman in the face, and you know what I'm saying? Punch him in the nose and all that stuff, man. You're going through physical abuse. That's what you're going through, physical abuse. And, and physical abuse is, is very, very, very dangerous. And you need to get out of this situation if you're in this you need to get out of the situation or if you even doing this a lot of your people who listen to this message you even into physical abuse okay that means you are abusing somebody okay you're probably bullying someone at school or your physical abuse then your husband or your wife you know in in, in some y'all you know be uh physical abuse your friends you're fighting on your friends and this this call a physical abuse okay that's right abuse you understand and you got to cut it out okay whoever who doing that kind of things like that if you uh physical abuse people or uh, whatever y'all be doing uh, uh physical abuse your friends and your loved ones you need to cut that out I'm telling you, you got to cut that out. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm telling you right now, your blood's going to be on your hand. And, and, and the most high will judge you, man. 
I'm, t- I'm telling you right, you better cut that out, man, because the blood's going to be on your hands, man. You know what I'm saying? You're going to be faced judgment by the most high, man. You got to cut that bull crap out, man, you know? When you're doing this mess, you're basically giving heed to Satan's kingdom. You service Satan's kingdom and when you into physical abuse. Seriously, y'all, I say so many people who are liberty into physical abuse and people are being uh, go, people being been through physical abuse man you got people and on family have been a, a physical abuse it's personally i have an auntie who's um with abused by her um husband you know what i'm saying you know i heard about my auntie was beaten up by her husband Back in the days in, in New Orleans, you know what I'm saying? And my husband beating on her and she beating on him and they fighting all that stuff. And they're still loving each other, you know what I'm saying? It's just it's just sad. It's just sad, man. You know, they got four kids, you know what I'm saying? And you know what I'm saying, I heard about they give her a black guy and all that stuff, man. My mommy telling me stuff, man, you know what I'm saying? And and I wasn't happy, you know what I'm saying? And she never called the laws and all that stuff, though. You know what I'm saying? She let the guy was beating on her and give her a black guy, you know. And and, and she think everything is love. That's not love at all. You know what I'm saying? How you going to tell me you love that person, that person was beating on you? You know what I'm saying? I ain't never be known a woman like that. You know what I'm saying? If I beat no women, man, that means I, I I I hate her. You know what I'm saying? Come on, man. Let's come a sense, man. Beat no beat no women, man. That's not that's not love. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You can go into jail for that for beating no women's, man. You know what I'm saying? You know? And this is this is what happened to my auntie, man. My auntie got beat up by her husband way long time ago. You heard me? That's not love. It's so sad. There are women out there. Believe a guy was beating on her was love. That's love, you know what I'm saying? Women really believe, you know, she got beaten up and, 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 and she think everything is love. No, it's not love. The guy's punching the woman in the face. They think that's hot. And you think teenagers' friends, to whereas you had teenager really literally hang with other friends or physically abusing them. You had teenager boys and girls. And Liberty hanging and other kids and the kids are physically pushing on them and physical abuse them. Sad and, and talk about that's my friend. Sick man. And that's ridiculous. Okay. And do you have the other kind of abuse? The, the, the different kind of abuse. He had emotional, he had emotional abuse. Now, an emotional abuse is the kind of the abuse people don't want to discuss. Because the emotional abuse is dangerous as the, as the physical abuse. The emotional abuse deals with in feelings. It deals with emotionals. I'm going to give you some example of emotional abuse. Okay. A woman, you know, a woman, emotional is hurting a man. That's emotional abuse. The woman is cheating on a guy. And she's doing it dirty. She's not treating him right. She's talking to him bad purposely to hurt his feelings. She's even do things around the house to hurt him, hurt him purposely. And start arguing. She got bad thinking problems. She's accusing. You know what I'm saying? Because she knows. Just she knows and she's trying to hurt his feeling. You know what I'm saying? She knows that. That's emotional abuse. Emotional abuse is just it's dangerous. It's the physical abuse because when you hurt someone emotionally and over and over and over, you're basically abusing that person, man. That's why it's called emotional abuse. It, it's emotional abuse, man. And you can abuse someone by abusing them emotionally. Seriously. It's just the truth, y'all. You know, it's just the truth. You can literally abuse someone by abusing them emotional way. And y'all people are doing this all doing this all the time. People do it in church, people do it in school, people do it in college, 
People doing it in everywhere. People doing it at home. You know what I'm saying? People doing it in the hood. Come on, man. People claim they're, they're father of the most high. Even doing this stuff. A lot of your people that are watching this message, you even, you know, are abusing people emotionally. You know how women be. You hurt me. The guy don't even do nothing wrong. She just emotional. You you did this. You did that. You did this. You did that. She don't even know. And she is emotionally abusing that guy. That's right. And a man do it too. And men do it. Men, men do it. Most brothers do it a same day. Men, men do women dirty. Men, you know, treat women like crap. There's a lot of sick, evil men out there and treat women like crap. You heard me? They are emotionally abusing the women. Then you have family members and friends, man. So-called family and friends to even emotionally abusing you. Your mama is emotionally abusing you to hurt your feelings purposely. Just doing all kinds of stupid, stupid sick stuff. Insane. A lot of sick stuff to hurt you food, to hurt you emotionally. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy, man. You got people who really hurt you emotionally, you know. You would do these favors, take this somewhere in your car, buy them some grocery, loan them some money. Help their family out, help pay, pay bills for them, and and and, and they don't want to give your money back. You know what I'm saying? You know what they're doing, y'all? They're doing to you emotionally hurt you, man. Purposely. That's right. That's right, y'all. A lot of you know what I'm saying. I know a lot of y'all people been through this, and I know a lot of y'all people uh done that stuff, man. Cause I have a daddy doing that stuff to me all the time. You know what I'm saying? He borrowed me. You know what I'm saying? He asking me, can I borrow $140? And I give him $140. You know what I'm saying? Because he's hungry. He's trying to get some something to eat. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you know what I'm saying? Him uh, him with my brothers and sister. You know what I'm saying? And he get paid. He ain't get my money back to me. You know what I'm saying? He do this to me all the time. Same thing for my brothers too on my daddy's side. He never give my money back. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? And see, you know... And this is crazy, you know I me. Mean? I have a family like that too. My own family members, my daddy too. You know, they don't want to pay me back. You know what I'm saying? Now you hurt. You know what it is? Emotionally abuse. You know what I'm saying? I've been through emotional abuse because my daddy he didn't get my money back. You know what I'm saying? That's what it is. That's emotionally abuse. Men do it to women. The women do it to men. Boy, do it to girls. Girl, do it to boys. Emotionally abused, y'all. It's so sad, y'all. The stuff is real. And a lot of you people, you be into this, man. And, and, and y'all need to stop. You need to cut that bullshit out, man. You need to cut that out, man. Because I'm telling you, your blood's going to be on your hand. I'm just keeping it, keep it real and keep it gutter with you all. You need to stop emotionally abusing a girlfriend. You need to stop emotionally abusing your boyfriend. You need to stop emotionally abusing your husband and your wife. You got to stop. This is, is not of the most high. It is a Satan. This is Satan. Here it is. A lot of women do this in marriages. And they promote it in the movies like it's hot. This, this is emotional abuse. See that? This the emotional abuse. People be doing this in Hollywood. You hear me? People be doing this in a movie. And people be doing this in Hollywood. Okay? My husband, you know, he was acting funny. So I ain't give him no sex tonight. Not knowing is emotional abuse. You need to tell me you're going to make your husband wait on some sex? Are you crazy? That's emotionally abuse. And y'all... In a market, in a promoting in Hollywood, all the films like it's hot. That's where you ain't getting none tonight. And the women, women, you know what I'm saying? And the women and, and, and tell their husband, you know, you ain't getting none till you give me some cash. You know what I'm saying? If you don't give me what I want, then you know what I'm saying? If you don't, if, if you don't give me what I want, I ain't giving you no sex. 
You know what I'm saying? And see, y'all sisters out there, y'all think it's hot. That's right. Y'all think it's hot. You ain't getting it tonight. You know what I'm saying? You just sitting there and telling your husband you are abusing him emotionally. And then you got men do the same thing with women. Now, I ain't had sex with you tonight. I ain't doing it to you. I'm bad. I'm having sex with you. I'm, I'm a set. And a man, he even make love to his wife on purpose because he angry, frustrated, and set. And guess what, y'all? That's emotionally abuse. That's emotionally abuse. That's right. Now the woman is her. He's her. It's a big mess. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. The two things you can do. If you in marriage like this, in, 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 in relationship like that, let me tell you what you do. If you go to most high, if you go to most high and, and get the life or you can just let it go and move on. Let me tell you. Some things, y'all, you just can't fix. Certain things you can't fix. You got to understand something. Certain people will never change. They will keep going with the stuff over and over and over and over and over again. They are leaving the garden. Keep going to the stuff until they die. And you just have to move on. You just have to move on. Me per And me personally, I'm keeping moving. I'm keeping moving because I'm not going back and forth and back and forth to go and do all this stuff, man. Not this new year, 2018, man. You know, I'm just keeping, I'm just keeping all the way 100 with you all. I'm keeping real and keep it gutter and I'm going to keep buck with you and not keep it 100 with you all. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? The people don't want to change. People just don't want to change and people just don't know how to change. You know what I'm saying? All you need to do as a person, just keep it moving and move on with your life. You know what I'm saying? Go to the most high, man. You know what I'm saying? Go to the most high or move on with your life. You know what I'm saying? And, and like I say this, man, ain't nobody going to the kingdom of heaven, man. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody... Ain't nobody going to the kingdom of heaven, man. Especially people who don't want to change. And people don't want to change to give their life to the most high. They're not, they're not going to make it to heaven. Okay? You just have to erase that stuff, man. You know what I'm saying? You can't force your, your brothers and your sister, your mom, your daddy, whoever. And, and bring it to the uh, most high kingdom. Because the people don't want to change. Okay? You just have to move on with your life. Just keep on moving. Just keep it moving. You know what I'm saying? Don't worry about them. Because they're not going to change. You see, and some of you people, you just have to move on. You cut the person off. You know what I'm saying? You got to divorce that sick wife. You got to divorce that sick husband. You have to move on. Let me tell you, if you keep going with this stuff, you are a find yourself hurting over and over and over and over. You are liberty of being emotionally abused. You're being emotionally abused. And emotionally abused is just as dangerous as physical abuse. Because because the person is hurting emotionally over and over and over, over and over and over and over again. And here it is. You keep trying to make it work. It ain't working like that. You know what I'm saying? If, you, if you're trying to make it work, it's not going to work. It's not going to work. I can't tell you. It's not going to work, man. You, you know what I'm saying? If you try to make everything work, you're going to get hurting and over and over and over and over and over again, man. Come on, man. This is serious, man. This is serious. You see, this is sad. You never get this stuff like this in church at all. Ain't no preachers out there and telling y'all the truth like this, man. This is so sad, man. You know? You know? You want to know why? Because half of the people in church, they are emotional hurting. They have emotionally abused. They don't want to be discussed like this in church. You know what I'm saying? And preachers don't want to talk about this. And everybody in church want to cover it up. <clears throat> just, it's just the truth. Everybody in church, they just want to cover everything up, man. I'm just keeping it real and keep it 100, man. Because well, customer jersey of people who claim themselves they follow the most high you know what i'm saying they claim themselves they follow the most high talk about they love jesus and all kind of stuff talk about 
um, I live my life to Christ and all that stuff, man. And people still be emotionally abused by some family members, by some friends, by some husband, by some wife. It's just the truth. Emotional abuse is very dangerous. You know what I'm saying? They really tear you up. They really tear you up in the inside in a heartbeat. It really they destroy your souls. It, let, let me tell you. Let me tell you, man. I know you're not going to like it, but let me tell you anyway. You constantly be emotionally abused. Here it is. If you constantly be emotionally abused, by your mom and your dad and your uncle, your brothers and your sister, your friends and any your husband, whoever, whoever, your loved ones, your boyfriend, your girlfriend. This stuff it eat you up so much. You know what I'm saying? They gonna eat you up. You don't have no strength anymore. You wanna lose your mind and you wanna have a nervous break, nervous breakdown, and you became a mental. You know what I'm saying? And you're gonna lose all your stuff in, in your walks with the most high. You know what I mean? You're going to lose your mind and you're going to destroy yourself with the, in the walks with the Most High. You're not even you're not even walk with the Most High no more because you be caught up with so-called cursed relationship and you caught up with your family members and you don't want to move on with your life. That's disgrace, man. That's disgrace. This is what happened. You don't want to move on with your life. You worry about your family. You worry about your relationship. You worry about your friendship. You worry about your so-called jobs. You worry about the nine to five jobs. You worry about this. You worry about that. I'm telling you what I know. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I know what's going on. A lot of people in these days, man, they don't want to walk with the most high. They've been so emotionally abused. They don't have no they don't have no strength to walk with the most high. My gosh, my gosh, oh my goodness, man. It's so sad to say this, man. I gotta speak the truth, man. That's right. You know what I'm saying? All of you for walk with the most high, you have to have strength. You gotta be free in the spirit. Me personally, man, I gotta be free. I want to be free. Cause I don't wanna be cut up with, with, with a curse relationship, with curse. People, what's in my life trying to destroy my life? No, I want to be free, man. I want you know, come on, man. I want to be free, man. And I want all of y'all to be free. I don't want y'all be caught up with what with, with mess. But y'all make the bad choices. You want to be with so called relationship, your husband, your wife, your bar from girlfriend, whoever, and your family members. That means you're not free. Here it is. How you gonna walk with the most high and yet you are and torn up in emotional abuse? You can't walk with the most high. You you be so emotionally abused whereas it, 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 it takes a life out of you. You know what I'm saying? Y'all emotional abuse, you can't but think straight. You can't but think straight. You know what I'm saying? You, you can't think straight. Your mind, your mind is gone. You can't focus on the most high. Because you're being emotionally abused by your mom and your daddy, your brothers, your sisters, your cousins, your uncles, your aunts, your friends, your husband, your wife. So how you walk with the most high and see, I'm going to tell you this, excuse me. I'm keeping it real. So some of your people, you know, some of your people, you just have to move on and let it go. I'm keeping 100. I'm I'm keeping 100, man. I'm keeping it real and keep it buck with you and keep it 100, man. You know what I'm saying? It's it's so sad that people in church give you a, a false hope, man. I I'm not gonna give you a, a false hope like Pastor be doing. Oh no, I'm not gonna give you the false hope like so-called mega preachers and deacon, uh 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 um um preachers um. You know what I'm saying? Um, Bishop, I'm not going to give you like the rest of the preachers do. You know what I'm saying? Because the preachers, they not give you no truth at all. It's shameful. I'm give you the real deal. I give you a real deal. I give you a work. Because a lot of things, I got to say this. reason why I'm not going to give you the false hope. Because a lot of people, you put yourselves in the situations. And, and the most high never ordained it's just the truth. A lot of your people, you put yourself to it, put yourself in situation, and the, mo the most high never ordained for you. 
and, and you're emotionally abused, you're hurting. I'm just keeping it real with y'all. Here's another one. Another kind of abuse is a mental abuse. Oh my gosh. And a mental abuse is dangerous too because the mental abuse deals with your mind. Oh Lord, a mental abuse deal with your mind. You got sick people abusing you mentally, sitting there telling you, you you never be nothing with God. That's right. You got sick fam family members. You got some sick family. Uh, man, I gotta, I got, I gotta say this, man. Forgive me, man. I, I gotta say this, man. They got some sick people in your family. They tell you you're not gonna be nothing with the Most High. You know what I'm saying? They got some sick people telling you all type of stuff, man. You got husband wives abusing you mentally. You know what I'm saying? I gotta say it because it's true. They done in you your walks with the most high. They're sitting here telling you, you'll never be nothing in God. You're sitting there down your walk with God and sitting there laugh at you. Think about they think the Bible's a joke or something. They are mentally abusing you, man. Because mental abuse deals with the mind. That's right, y'all. And y'all. Christian people, Lord have mercy, man. God, Christian people be mentally abusing people. They do this 24 7, just like the worldly people do, man. Here it is. I'm using myself as a person example. And you look at all the people who try to attack me online in the past. You know what I'm saying? And you seen. You know, when, have you seen, you know, on Facebook, my baby mama, wicked sister, trying to attack me, say all kind of wicked stuff to me, talk about I have mental problems, and telling me I'm the devil and all that stuff. And they, you know, they say, they talk about you're never going to get my job. This, she telling me you're not going to get your son back. You have a mental problems and all type of stuff. Is that true? It's already uh, spoken. They were trying to do it basically to commit abuse. That's right. Trying to make me think I don't hear in the most high. They're trying to make me think I'm tripping. Trying to make me think I'm losing my mind. Saying kind of stuff about me. Jonah is a false prophet. Jonah this, Jonah that, Jonah's a lie. Jonah, Jonah got mental problem. Jonah have a, a nervous problem. Jonah this, Jonah that, Jonah's retarded. Jonah, Jonah, Jonah ain't smart. Jonah have a, a, a mental, a mental problem. He have a whatever they say about me. You know what I'm saying? You know what's called a million things about Jonah. You know what they doing? It's mental abuse. They trying to mentally abuse my mind. Here it is, man. You know, I have a brother like that too. You see me? I don't play it on mine. Because I already know what it's all about. Satan was using them to try to mentally abuse me. To make me think I'm tripping. Let me tell you something about this walks with the Most High. You got a deep relationship with the Most High. And you... Or, or, and you in this high, high, higher, 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 and you walks with the most high. People are always trying to make you think you tripping. That's mental abuse, man. They're trying to make you believe that God's not even talking to you. That's mental abuse. That's mental abuse. They're talking about all uh, uh, John and crazy. Jonah retarded. Jonah talk about some crazy stuff. Jonah think he hear God. Jonah think Jonah think Jonah think he he's perfect. He think he better than us. Jonah's retarded, man. Hey, don't be listen to that boy video. Jonah is retarded, man. Don't listen to it. Ain't nobody care about Jonah. You know what it's called? Abuse, man. He tripping. Jonah, what you mean I'm tripping? You got to be crazy. How, what else will you think about me? Come on, y'all. I almost believe, but the devil, they give you messages like this to rich people? Hell no. Because the devil don't, the 
devil don't want you to, to reach souls from hell. It's meant to abuse. You know what I'm saying? Because the devil, he don't want you to hear the truth. He don't want y'all to hear the truth. The devil just use y'all to hunt against Jonah, man. That's what they trying to do. They use my baby mama evil family members to against me. Her mama trying to do inner power to use my baby mama to against me. And she and, and her mama and her sister trying to get her other sister trying to against me. The one I cool with. They're trying to against me. All the stuff what I'm doing in the most high. You know what I'm saying? Now you have a friends and, and, and tell you all kind of dirty stuff to you. It don't make, make no sense. Your mama is mentally abusing you. Tell you stuff purposely to get in your head. That's right. That's right. And people in church are mentally abusers. To where the people in church are literally trying to corrupt your mind. It's meant to abuse. Your people, here it is. And people had wives and husbands to mentally abuse you, man. Your own wife. Your own wife. Mentally abusing you. Your own husband mentally abuse you. Your boyfriend, your girlfriend mentally abuse you. Your cousins and your uncles and fake friends mentally abusing you. It's mental abuse. That's what it is. Because, because mental abuse, abuse affects a brain. That's right. And here, here it is. This is why can be listened to everybody. You can be listened to everybody. Me personally, I don't listen to no freaking body, man. Because I already know what they be up to. I already know what we'll be up to. It's something, it's the truth. It's not the truth. It's just that. Let me let me tell you. Let me tell you that. You listen to this person, to that person, that. You listen to that person, this person, that person, that. You know what I'm saying? What happens that you are lying to them to commit, uh, commit to abuse in your brain. You know what I'm saying? Because you listen to too many people. And see me personally. I'm, I'm keeping real and keeping gutter with you all. And me personally, you know. I don't listen to everybody. You know what I'm saying? Let me be honest with you. I used to listen to everybody. I listen to my friends, man. They're trying to be in my business. You know what I'm saying? They're trying to uh, uh, correct me. They're trying to challenge me and all that stuff. You know what I'm saying? Me personally, I was refused to listen, but I don't want to listen. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to listen to everybody because I know exactly what they're trying to do to me. They're trying to control me. They're trying to manipulate me. You, me personally, man, I'm not, I'm not listening to everybody. I now listen to everybody because I already know what they up to, man. My own friends trying to tell me what to do, tell me what they don't do, and all that stuff, though. You know what I'm saying? You want to know why I don't listen to everybody I talk about? Then listen to everybody. It's waste of time. And when you walk with the Most High and you're doing His will for your life, you have to move forward. I'd not be caught up with the now stuff. You heard me? And listen and, and, and listen to what that person was saying. What that person saying. What that person was talking about. And what that person was talking about. Man, when the most high will show me something. And show me and the most high will show me some man. Because you listen to all of these different people. People are coming abusing you, man. On you. That's right, man. That's right. It's just the truth, man. You know what I'm saying? You be listening to all that people was saying to you. You know what I'm saying? That's meant to abuse you, man. Don't let that happen. Don't let that happen to you guys, man. You know what I'm saying? And whoever who listen to my videos, and a lot of y'all people be doing that stuff on you, man. Shame on you. You should be ashamed of yourself. And, and you're going to get judged by the most high, man. Because you be uh, mentally abused people, man. For real, man. Y'all need to cut that out, man. Y'all need to cut that out, man. And y'all people, man, but been through this, man, you got to keep it moving. You need to start listening to people, man. You got to keep it forward. You got to keep it forward. Because you don't want nobody to affect your mind, man. Just keep it moving. Just be strong, man. Ask the Most High to give you wisdom and knowledge, man. And that's all I got to be said, man. I just give you three things, man. 
three things, man. And I just have to expose everything, y'all. And that's all I gotta be said. It's your boy Jonah TB War. I give you a hot on fire truth on you, man. For real, man. I'm saying some hot true stuff, man. And that's all I gotta be said. I'm out, y'all. Peace.